Hi everyone. Let us start with 7.3 Satellite Motion. What does it mean by satellite? Any object which is revolved about a bigger mass, we call it satellite. For example, moon, okay, mengelilingi bumi. Okay, so moon as a satellite. Or if this one is earth, bumi mengelilingi matahari. Okay, so this one, another satellite which is earth. Okay, we are not only has natural satellite, we do have artificial satellite. For example, okay, Malaysia have a satellite where we call this name. Okay, so this one important for, for example for Astro to provide many TV program for residents in several country, right? So we have satellite motion. So what we concern is actually speed for the satellite. How we are going to derive the equation for the speed for the satellite? So for information, for the satellite revolve about the bigger mass, centripetal force important. Okay, so we back to chapter six, F actually equals to MA. This A is actually, I can express it in V squared over R. And what provides centripetal force here? For information, these two planets are actually attracted with some force. And this force, what do we call? According to the Newton law of gravitation, this force we call gravitational force. Okay, the D formula gravitation force, gravitational force, begini kan? Okay. Both side are the small m. Both side are the r. Okay, tadi yang tinggal ini. Speed for the satellite ya. Eh? Saya nak gini kan? Square root both side, I will get this. Okay, so always remember M stand, capital M stand for bigger mass. Bigger mass in this case, for example, kalau ini moon, ini earth. Okay, kalau ini earth. So bigger M here, capital M here refer to mass for the earth. Alright, jadi ini speed for the satellite and next, you need to know period for the satellite as well. So for the period for the satellite for information, okay. Mereka makan mula dari sini. Okay, equation ni. Saya dapati bahawa V sama juga dengan V ni. Sama juga distance bagi masa kan. Kalau distance ni, jarak yang dilalui oleh satellite dalam satu complete cycle ni, jarak untuk satu bulatan ni, lilitan kan. So, kita ada formula lilitan, circumference, actually equals to 2 pi r, masa untuk satu pusingan lengkap, sama dengan period kan. Okay, so I'm going to use this. Sebab kita nak cari period lah. Capital T. Okay, so what do I do? Ni dia kembangkan dulu lah. Dia ada ni r square, dia kena di t square, sama juga dengan ni. Okay. So what I want T. So what do I do? Pindahkan 4 pi square r square ke sebelah kanan. So what do I have? Saya ada ni. Okay. Sampai sini, apa yang saya nak buat? Ini bahagi GM OA kan? Jadi kalau saya nak buat darab, apa yang saya akan buat? Bahagi, saya akan jadikan darab eh. Jadi kalau saya darab, fraction ni inverted kan? Okay. Begini. Okay. Dan apa, kalau saya simplify, R square darab dengan R, saya dapat R cube kan? Okay, R cube yang bahagi GM lah, betul? Okay. Di sini T square kan? Saya nak T. Jadi apa yang saya buat? Square root 4 pi square. Square root 4 pi square, saya dapat 2 pi lah kan? Tapi yang lain ni, saya dapat, tak dapat simplify dah. Okay. So that's why formula for the period is like that. 
Alright Jadi untuk video ni Sebelum saya end kan Class ini Video ini Information You should know what is mean by Synchronous satellite Apa maksud synchronous satellite For example this one earth And this one artificial satellite ya Artificial satellite ada certain satellite di mana untuk memudahkan contohnya untuk memudahkan, untuk memudahkan astro untuk supaya lepas pemasangan piring tu kita tak payah ubah-ubah kedudukan piring untuk untuk mengelakkan kita menukarkan kedudukan piring ini for example ni satellite yang kita guna dekat Malaysia itu nama ni satellite nama ni Actually, it's a synchronous satellite. What is mean by that? Maksudnya, kalau bumi pusing je, ini pun akan ikut pusing. Maksudnya, as you know, earth rotation, earth rotation as I told you before, okay, how much time do you earth rotate once? Contohnya, saya bumi, okay, berapa masa untuk bumi pusing Buat satu pusingan, berapa lama? As you know, 24 hours, right? Jadi kalau Earth rotation, Earth rotation 24 hours, Synchronous satellite, okay? Also, the period, for information, period untuk Synchronous satellite juga 24 jam. Jadi ini, nilai ini penting, penting untuk Penting untuk ni, penting untuk konsep ni. You should know for synchronous satellite, the period is actually 24 hours, which is same as Earth rotation. Jadi untuk video ni itu je. Bye.